What's going on guys, Orange Keebler here, back with another Destiny video. As many of you already know, Iron Banner has once again returned and Lady Ephrodi has set up shop in Felwinter's Peak. As usual, she has brought some items for us to buy once we hit the specified rank and bounties to fulfill and be rewarded for. Now aside from the vendor rolled items that you can buy from her right now, the bounties will reward items that she is not currently selling. The only other items that you can receive are the random end of match rewards that are items she is currently selling but with the possibility of a different role. These items might also include a specific artifact, ghost shell, sparrow, or ship that are all Iron Banner themed. And just as a reminder, all rank 3 and 5 packages have been retired. This new Iron Banner reward system that Bungie has implemented is all about getting more gear drops and helping you get to light level 400. Is she staring at me? She's staring at me, isn't she? On that note, let's go see what she's got. First set of arms has intellect and discipline with an increased melee attack speed and increased reload of hand cannons. The second set of arms has discipline and strength with an increased grenade throw distance and an increased reload of auto rifles. First set of chest armor has intellect and discipline with an increased amount of hand cannon ammo that can be carried and also increased recovery after solar splash damage. The second set of chest armor has discipline and strength and also increase the hand cannon ammo you can carry plus the recovery after arc splash damage. The titanium orchid does arc damage and has aggressive launch, smart drift control, hard launch, javelin, fitted stock, lightweight, flared magwell, grenades and horseshoes, and cluster bombs. The Binding Blaze, which does solar damage, has Hand Loaded, Injection Mold, Snapshot, Feather Mag, Range Finder, and Cascade. There are four Iron Banner bounties. Each one will reward you with 5,000 experience, 25 legendary marks, and 750 Iron Banner standing. You will also get either an Iron Banner legendary weapon or armor that is not being sold by the vendor. The first bounty is Iron Marathon. Earn 100 points by playing Iron Banner. Match complete equals 5, match win equals 10. This one will also reward you a legendary weapon. The second bounty is Iron Light. Earn 100 points with ability kills at the Iron Banner. Grenade equals 2, melee equals 3, super equals 5, and this will reward you legendary armor. The third bounty is Iron Arsenal. Earn 100 points with weapon kills at the Iron Banner. Primary equals 1, special equals 2, heavy equals 5, and this will also reward you a legendary weapon. The last bounty is Iron Support. Earn 100 points supporting your teammates at the Iron Banner. Assisted kills equals 1, Avenger kills equals 3, allies defended equals 5. You can also get a legendary piece of armor from this. Now as I said before, this new reward system is geared towards more rewards dropping and all the items max out at 400 light. So this is a good way to farm for infusion material that will help boost you up to 400 light. Well guys, that's it for this video. As always, I look forward to seeing you out on the battlefield. I'm Orange Keebler and I've got your six.